Good morning! Welcome back. Today is Friday and we have a new story. Our story is time to graduate. And it's written by Katherine Hapka. And we're going to read this book today because pretty soon you guys will be in first grade. And you'll be with a new teacher and with new friends and learning lots of new things. But I wanted to get you guys ready, so I thought I'd read this story, Time to Graduate. So let's get into it. Emma is in kindergarten, but the school year is almost over. A lot of you may look like this right now. Good morning, class, Miss Green says. I cannot believe today is our last day in kindergarten. Emma tells her friends. If we were inside school, you guys would look like this. Yes, Jack says, we will graduate today. Ben looks sad. I will miss kindergarten, he says. It's time for art, Miss Green says. She hands out paper and paint. This will be our last art project in kindergarten, Abby says. Later, Ben stares at his lunch. This will be our last lunch in kindergarten, he says. After lunch, it is time for recess. Gavin kicks a soccer ball. This will be our last recess in kindergarten, he says. It's time for math, says Miss Green. This is the last time we will count blocks in kindergarten, Roberto says. So how are our friends feeling right now? Are they all happy? They're kind of sad, right? Why are they sad? Right. Then it is the end of the day. It is time to graduate. Here are your caps, kids, Miss Green says. Emma puts on her cap. Her friends do too. This is the last time we will play dress up in kindergarten, Emma says. Miss Green, here's Emma. This is the last time you were playing dress up in kindergarten, she says. But it's also the first time you were putting on graduation caps. Hey, that is true, Emma says. Line up for graduation class, Miss Green says. This is the first time we are doing this too, Abby says. Emma smiles. Abby is right. Miss Green's students walk across the stage one by one. She gives them each a piece of paper. Soon it is Emma's turn. She takes her paper. Congratulations, Emma, Miss Green says. You are a kindergarten graduate. Now we are all kindergarten graduates, Jack says. Yes, Emma agrees for the first time. Soon we will be doing something else for the first time, Ben says. What, Emma asks. Ben smiles, starting first grade. Emma smiles too. Kindergarten was great. But first grade will be even better. So, boys and girls, I just want to tell you, yes, you'll be moving on from kindergarten and going to a new classroom. It doesn't mean that I will forget about you. I will always remember you. And I'm only going to be just down the hall from you. So anytime you walk by on your way to the bathroom or going to the library, you can wave and I'll wave back. I may not say hey, but I'll 
I'll still wait that because I'll be in the middle of teaching my new kindergartners. And now you'll be new role models for the younger kids. So, yes, yeah, sometimes it's sad to leave things behind, but you get to do so many new things. So, I'm so excited for you, and I hope you are too, to go to the first grade. Our story today was Time to Graduate by Katherine Hapka. I hope you guys liked it, and I'll see you tomorrow. Bye!